the experience it was amazing with Tagi Airlines. I just loved it. Sometimes we just I, I I flew with a lot of airlines and the flight attendants they're not that nice. And I can affirm for sure that the flight attendants, the girls from Tag Airlines, they were so happy, so happy. I wonder if the, the people from Emirates, they will be as happier as the Tag Airlines uh, flight attendants. And uh, wow, it's interesting. Well, it's very warm here. And uh, some, well, I have a lot of good things to tell. In the airplane, it was amazing. It was, I was so happy. I took photos with the guys. I, I went to the cabin. I took photo of the panel. I didn't take photo with the pilots, but it's okay. And another thing very cool is that here, different fr from Tunisia, for example, the taxi drivers, they are not picky. They are not, I mean, not picky. They are not aggressive because in some countries they are very aggressive. They say, come with me, come with me. And, and, and here, and here not. Here they're very, here they're very calm, at least <laughs> so far. And I'm going to my hostel, from the airport to my hostel, maybe it's 10 minutes. And so let's see. Você como se chama? Meu nome é José Luiz. Ah, muito gosto. Meu nome é Jefferson. Jefferson. Sim, sí, sim. Sí. Ah, muito gosto. Me encanta a Guatemala. Me está gostando bastante. Bonito. É um país bem bonito. A gente é muito cálida, não? Bem-vindo, Carmen. Graças. Lacuna do Império Maia. Ah, mira. É o verdadeiro nome. Lacuia? Lacuna. A Lacuna do Império Maia. You guys come to Flores, Flores El Pepin. This is the base to see Tikal. I recommend everybody to stay at Don Senobio. My few, my first, maybe minutes, not hours, minutes in this hostel. It's already been a great experience. It has been amazing. The owner, uh, Rodrigo, is very nice. And also there is a girl from France. We have been practicing French. I've been talking French what? with her, and uh, it has been really great, really nice. And here I am in the island of Flores. It's a very beautiful island. And from here, I'm gonna go to take a bus, I think it's a bus or a van, I'm not sure, to visit Tikal. My owner, Rodrigo, the, sorry, the owner of the hostel, Rodrigo, he helped me a lot to book uh, the tickets to Tikal in advance. So, whoa, they're so lovely. They're really, really nice. And uh, it's very, it's very cheap, this hostel. One night I paid 100, 120 quetzals and uh, the transportation to Tikal, I think I paid 250 quetzals and uh, 100 quetzals to enter the park and 150 quetzals to see the sunset. So yeah, it's, it's cheap, it's not expensive. A very narrow street and a lot of cars are entering here ah okay the bus will the bus will depart from there I love Petain nice it was very easy to arrive here so this is the island guys it's very calm here it's very beautiful Really, really nice. Hola, buenas, buenas. I'm 
We live in Central America. Central America is a magical place. It has so many great things to do and to see. A lot of volcanoes, a lot of nice people, nature, animals, great food. Uh, and, and in general, the countries of Central America, they are not expensive. Uh, maybe Costa Rica is a little more expensive. All the prices of the tours are based in US dollars. A lot of Americans travel a lot to Costa Rica. Also, there are a lot of Americans living in Costa Rica. And maybe this is the reason why prices in Costa Rica are more expensive. One tour to a volcano in, in Costa Rica, I remember, it was more than 100 US dollars. So it's very expensive. And uh, also, there are a lot of retirees, retired Americans living in Costa Rica. So this is another reason why this country is expensive. Panama is a little expensive as well, especially because their currency is US dollars. And apart from Panama, all the other countries, Honduras, um, what else? El Salvador, Nicaragua, Guatemala, they are they're not they're not that expensive. I need to cross here. You can see if there are cars coming. So the bus will pick up me from here. I love Petain. I love Petain. And let's wait. This is the pickup. I think less than 15 minutes they will arrive here. Right now I'm here at the entrance of Tikal Park. I have my guide here, he's speaking for a part of the group in Spanish and for another part of the group in, in English. And uh, we just arrived here, we went to the bathroom, we had some, some dinners there, we passed it through the security here and now the guide is explaining everything to, to the groups and uh, it's very cool there are people from many countries from germany from france from chile myself from brazil and those, and he was explaining about this tree here seba this tree is the national tree of guatemala and uh, yeah a very special tree here in the region I thought it was snakes. The original name is Tik Al, the, the Mayan name, but for foreigners it's easier to say Tikal. Well, interesting. <laughs> And the Seva trees, they survive around 300 years, so this is awesome, this is really amazing. It's very nice to be here at Tikal, this place is precious. The Mayan civilization started way back Christ was born, 2500 years before Christ was born. This is the oldest civilization when compared to the Incas and Aztecas. Aztecas and Incas, they came after the, the Mayans. And we can see here the Mayans temples. They are really, really beautiful. In the middle of these temples, uh, we can found like kings were buried here.
This is our sacrificial stones. Actually, they use these stones to make sacrifices. They use the blood of the, the people who were sacrificed here, who were killed here, to make rituals. Here we have some stones with some old writings of that time. More stones where they killed people, enemies. And let's keep going on. I think there is a mask right here. Let's see. We are entering the zone of the holler monkey. Listen to the sound of this monkey. I love it. Templo Cuatro. This is the Temple Four. Temple Four and Temple Three that we walk around. The monkeys are in the temple. Here I am in the Temple Number Four. Here is the highest temple we have here, and uh, it's really beautiful. All these trees, all this forest. It's really awesome. And then we have here. All the all this structure, everybody's ready here. Ah, nice, really cool.